Yes. So, uh, in the last session, what we saw is. Um, so we were speaking about cloud computing. So what is a cloud computing? What are the advantages? Different uh, companies, uh, cloud companies that uh, we have and what is Oracle Cloud, different products that cl Oracle Cloud has. Yeah. So these are the topics that we saw last week. So uh, in simple terms, so uh, just I'm just recalling whatever we saw in the first mm -hmm. uh, session. So cloud computing is connecting to the physical uh, like uh, uh, physical servers and machines through an internet and accessing the application and uh, a space through internet. Uh, and then advantages of storing advantages of cloud is uh, it can be stored anywhere in the world and can be accessed from anywhere and anytime from the world and the cost of the servers or uh, like or with the service providers and not with us and uh, these are the few companies like amazon google uh, azure or few companies who provide uh, cloud uh, services and we missed this particular slide and these are few uh, like few products which are available in the market uh, eip products so sap microsoft dynamics workforce sales force uh, i believe you have worked on workday right yeah okay you worked on workday and we have uh, workforce as well uh, uh, which is yeah i'm sorry i did not work on workday uh, yeah i took training from here yeah. Okay, 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 and uh, Salesforce and Oracle Fusion Cloud, and um, again, Oracle Cloud is similar to uh, the general cloud system, cloud computing system. But uh, thing is, everything is provided by Oracle Corporation, and then different products that are offered by Oracle Cloud, uh, Oracle uh, NetSuite, Java, Pe uh, PeopleSoft, and so on. And then we also looked into what are the uh, functions that uh, Oracle Fusion has, like uh, uh, um, like financial management, H HCM, supply chain, recruitment, and so on. Yeah. And then we saw what is workforce deployment, what is workforce development, compensation management like uh, we saw overview of what these uh, topics are. Mm -hmm. And then we saw uh, how uh, uh, I mean what uh, I mean. Yeah, exactly the same thing uh, we saw in the um, application level. What are the offerings been provided by Oracle? And then yeah, uh, we tried uh, to get uh, details of uh, um, we tried to get details of um, uh, not details actually. We tried to create uh, users, right? We tried to create users, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, we saw what is what is a role, how a role works, and so on. So, uh, is there anything else that I missed? No, that's it. We did. Yeah, we created that one. Uh, the user thing. User, yes. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and we saw basics of um, I believe uh, um, enterprise structure, right? Uh, uh, and yeah, we saw how to navigate through uh, Navigator as well as through setups, uh, setup and setup and settings, right? And mm -hmm. so how the product looks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. System. Sorry. So. Um, for every day, uh, is it okay if we have a session for one hour or uh, one hour, 15 minutes or half an hour? I mean, one and a half hours. How do you uh, like to go ahead? Yeah, yeah, one hour, one hour, 15 minutes is okay. One yeah, we can, is okay. yeah, we can go one, yeah, one hour, 15 minutes. I think it's fine because fine, right? 11 o'clock. Yeah. yeah, yeah, sure. Okay. 
So yeah, I have logged into uh, the Oracle system uh, application. So I hope you are able to see. Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. So we managed to see uh, how the navigator looks and uh, how the home page looks. And uh, yes, and we have to be patient because it takes some time for the uh, server to bring in the details. And uh, we also saw a uh, setup and maintenance menu. Perfect. So these are the things that we saw last week. I mean, sorry, last class. Yeah. yeah. And yeah, uh, let me take day two. So in day two, what we are going to see is like uh, I have split it into two two parts like enterprise setup configuration. That is the topic that we are going to see in uh, today's class and uh, I have split it into two parts because uh, we have to do a lot of configuration. So it is best to have an hands on uh, as much as possible so that we are confident enough to move forward. Yeah. So stop me if you are not able to understand or if I'm going fast. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. So what is enterprise structure or organization structure? So before we see uh, this uh, like definition, which uh, which was in uh, which was available in I mean, which is actually available in online. So um, from from your opinion, like from your opinion, what do you what do you feel like? What do you think an enterprise structure is? Um, enterprise structure like the hierarchy. Yes, uh, yes, yeah. you're right. You're uh, uh, yeah, you're close enough. Like uh, um, when when and we say tree. enterprise, yeah, yeah, please go ahead. The structure, the tree structure of the organization, like the top level Perfect. to the bottom level. Yes, yes, you're absolutely right. You're absolutely right. So uh, it is the combination like a, a company, department, division, legal yeah. entity, business unit. So how it is arranged or how it is configured. So in Oracle, if we, uh, I mean, in Oracle, um, the system is set up like uh, the table structure, the functionality is set up in such a way that it allows uh, uh, allows the companies uh, or clients to set up their company structure in an organized manner so that uh, um, uh, it will be easier for maintaining the departments divisions and so on uh, department divisions when i say department divisions it's um, once again uh, branch and so on yeah mm -hmm. so uh, this is the definition so every enterprise uh, has three fundamental structure legal managerial and functional. Mm -hmm. So uh, if we simply learn this, I mean read this, uh, it doesn't make uh, much sense. But uh, if we look at the enterprise, like uh, if we look at the pictures, this image, we should be able to understand uh, what actually they mean. Yeah. So uh, business, uh, I mean. The, the blue box is the company uh, inside a company we have different legal entities so that's legal access legal entities in the sense if a company wants to open uh, like uh, yeah if client wants to open a company in india then they can actually um, register legally in bangalore or in chennai yeah, uh, or in delhi and so on yes so it is going to be a uh, it may be an head office so when we say head office, head office is going to be the company actually enterprise, actually uh, actual enterprise. And yeah. then uh, the le legal uh, like legal entity can be multiple like there can be multiple legal entity. Yeah. And uh, once uh, once we have created a legal entity, say in Chennai, they have a legal entity. Uh, the client can open multiple branches across Chennai. So mm -hmm. uh, so branches are nothing but business unit. Okay. Yeah, according to according to the Oracle's uh, structure, so uh, that there, there may be different structure in different uh, products uh, in, in the product that we are working on, like uh, I am working on currently in, in my company. Uh, we have uh, we say as org levels. 
so we don't call it as uh, business unit uh, or uh, uh, departments division uh, mm. when we say department and division it is completely different from what oracle setup has from what we are actually uh, do, i mean yeah we are actually setting it up in our product in my uh, company so in oracle the structure is like this like first is uh, first is a maybe i can show you like this so first is going to be the enterprise company mm -hmm. and then the division division is uh, india division and usa division so mm -hmm. two countries in two countries if the uh, company wants to have uh, branches then not branches actually um, uh, company wants to open in two countries so india and usa so it is uh, it is said as division this is an optional uh like uh, this, this is an optional setup that uh, we can perform in oracle so why we have like why company wants to have it in two countries is they want to ha have uh, or they want to calculate all the profit and loss in two different places they will like uh, if uh, reliance, i mean yeah reliance and uh, uh, many many big shots have uh, different companies i mean companies in different countries right and they showcase their uh, profit and loss based on the country they would say in india i gained this much and i lost this much and in usa i gained this much and i lost this much so mm -hmm. uh, so these like financial uh, calculations are performed separately in these countries separately uh, in country wise actually and in india uh, they can have multiple legal entities like uh, uh, in delhi they can register the company and also in chennai they can register a company so these are legal entities and it doesn't require that uh, they have to uh, register multiple times a company can register once us also like uh, a company can have only one uh, like division in india so uh, so we can remove the division itself like that's why it is called uh, it is optional uh, straight away we can configure the legal entity uh, in india in chennai maybe or in delhi and then in delhi they can have multiple branches so uh, and in chennai they can have multiple branches and uh, likewise in uh, new york and uh, los angeles they can have multiple branches so and then if you notice here we, uh, it also mentioned that the enterprise i mean uh, in oracle uh, enterprise structure we also have functional axis so functional axis are department divisions uh, mm -hmm. departments jobs division uh, not divisions actually location and so on so it's mostly related to functional level so uh, the legal level and uh, business units are places or location right uh, this is where uh, they have registered and this is where the business are going to run and what kind of business what function is going to be executed in each of these uh, places are uh, like shown here in functional axis so as mentioned uh, previously like uh, um, this uh, the first step like uh, first detail that we collect from client is how many companies they are going to have uh, definitely it's going to be one company and uh, from there uh, uh, which country like in which country they have uh, their uh, companies open like are the apart from the head office if they have any companies open and then uh, we have something called ldg which is legislative data group and ledger so these two are uh, uh, are coming under finance setup it doesn't come in, come under uh, our hcm setup but it comes under finance setup however we need to understand what it is so whenever we create like uh, uh, if if there are divisions under each country then we will have to definitely create a uh, legislative data group so um, we can see what uh, what are the details we have in legislative data group um, where when we go through uh, the uh, console itself yeah uh, application 
so when we are try when we try to i mean when we are creating the enterprise structure we can see how legislative data groups are uh, configured and then the ledger so finance setup that is, that is also a financial uh, finance setup uh, i have written it as financial setup okay uh, so what ledger means is ledger can have multiple details like uh, it is separated as currency like uh, the details that a ledger can have is currency calendar chart of accounts and compliances so mm -hmm. to put it is uh, put it in an uh, like um, to give you an example how it works uh, i'm just uh, opening an excel sheet you might feel it vague now but uh, when we try to uh, when we start creating uh, these details right when we configure try to configure these details in uh, application uh, you'll be able to understand more clearly mm -hmm. yeah so say for example uh, a com the company has um, like brought uh, bought uh, bought not bought uh, have yeah uh, taken up a building in mips so they are paying rent right so they are paying rent and uh, mm, when we say maps it is it is in uh, say chennai uh, yeah place uh, like a building or yeah yes yes a building so building for rent so uh, and uh, from when maybe today's date is 9 right so um, uh, is it 9 or 8 over there it's 8 here yeah. 8 yeah. right yeah. <laughs> okay so yeah, uh, say uh, it's eight May 2023. Mm -hmm. From this date, uh, from date, the company has rented uh, MIPS, and uh, what we are doing is we are paying in cash. Uh, cash. Pay, I'm sorry. Yeah, payment method as cash and. Uh, Mm, currency, yeah. Currency is rupees, which means uh, th this is the normal term that we use, right? So uh, what I'm doing is I'm going to uh, like uh, I'm going to pay rent, and uh, from when uh, from when it's going to be from today, 8 May, and uh, cash is the payment method and rupees. But um, this is this is exactly the same for currency. Like uh, when we say rent, rent is going to be chart of accounts. So I will put everything here. So currency. So this is uh, this is under ledger. Ledger. It is split as currency, calendar. Uh, chart of accounts. Chart of accounts and compliances method. Yeah. So if we uh, like match these things, so this is going to be the calendar, and uh, this is going to be the chart of account. Like uh, for for what reason we are going to pay. Uh, cash or pay something to uh, a person or something. So, complaints method is and uh, cash and currency is rupees. So, these details are saved under ledger. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, are you feeling like uh, are you feeling bored, like uh, uh, not interested uh, or something like that? Like maybe mm -hmm. we can oh, like yeah, it's just theory. So like how okay. does it work? That's it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. We can uh, quickly go through uh, all the things. Um, so if you see here, company division, LDG like uh, legislative data group, and ledger, uh, legal entity, and business unit. These are uh, all com combined together. Like uh, these are combined together. Uh, and these are uh, these will be configured uh, like uh, the last line, right? Uh, you can ignore this line for now because 
departments jobs grades location will be configured separately so uh, these are functional level right so the all these functional level details are configured separately and for each business unit these function needs to be linked so how it is linked is it is linked using rds rds is reference data set yeah so uh, reference data set uh, will be linked to a business unit and uh, department job grade location all these details will be linked to rds mm -hmm. okay and uh, we have looked into this and these are a few uh, like links that we have which will help us like uh, you you asked for uh, locations where i mean links yeah through which you can uh, get some documents, right? So mm -hmm. Oracle books. Um, so the first uh, the first uh, link is this one where you can see you can get actually download all the related uh, documents. So how to create a user plan. I mean user guide. Uh, for all the topics still the problem is say for example if I open time and labor. So it has lot of uh, uh, like lot of descriptions like uh, uh, it has been. It has been explained in uh, um, like clearly here. However, if we look into all these topics uh, through uh, a, through a session and then if you go into this and read, you will be able to make some sense like uh, yes, this is what has been taught uh, on that day and something like that. So you can relate to uh, whatever is available here. Yeah, uh, you can anyway go through these uh, topics um, in the in this in these links. So what I will do, I will I think yeah, you uh, can that forward way. the slide show. Yeah, the slides. Yeah, to me. yeah, yeah. Uh, slide. Yeah, I can uh, I will. Uh, yes, I will forward the slide to you. So just in case uh, I miss it, I will quickly share it with you. Yeah. I've shared all the links. One, two, three. Perfect. So uh, I believe let's start uh, configuring as uh, enterprise structure. So enterprise structure configuration uh, can be performed manually as well as through wizard. So wizard is a easy method uh, how uh, like easy method to do like uh, it will it will give us do this step first and then the next step and then the next step and so on. So uh, do you want to share your screen? Yeah, and log into system so I can guide you. Yeah, I'll stop sharing. Oh. Where do we share here? I don't know. I forgot. So yeah, did you get it? Uh, turn whole call incoming calls. No, uh, like yeah, did got it. Perfect. Yes, I can see your screen. Uh, so I think I have to go here. This was the link. Yes, that's the link. Maybe uh, what you can do is you can um, like create. Yeah, you uh, can mark it or else you can uh, save it in a notepad or uh, because in every day we are going to use it. So uh, you can store it in a notepad uh, yeah. instead of folder saying that. Uh, yeah, um, Oracle Fusion class something like that. Yeah.
It's too slow. Yeah, yeah, I understand. So I have also opened it up um, side. Yes, perfect. Now uh, on the right top, like um, yeah, maybe you can move this uh, Skype window. The settings. Yes, please. Setup and maintenance. So most of things we will be working using setup and maintenance. Over here, search task, right? In this, uh, do you remember what we searched last? Uh, uh, I mean, yesterday. Like uh, uh, before, yeah. Enterprise structure configurator. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So you can click. I mean, you can search for. I mean, in the search uh, search task, yeah, on the right okay. side. Just under it. Just under it. Not here. Not here. Not here. Oh, okay. Then. On the right side, uh, search tasks. Yeah, yeah. Your mouse pointer is there. Actually. This one. Yes. Perfect. Okay. Enterprise. Yeah, uh, now search. So manage enterprise structure, the first option. Establish. I mean establish, establish enterprise structure, yes. Again, click on establish enterprise structure. So now we can see Vision Corporation. That is the only enterprise uh, available here. So now click on plus symbol. Yes. yes. Now provide a name. Uh, um, like maybe we can come up with uh, some companies detail, right? Already existing company. Mm. You can do ING. Uh, yes, I yes. I yes, yes. With ING, yeah. OK, so maybe you can provide uh, provide some description as well. Uh, I believe uh, you have uh, left a space right after ING. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yes, please. Yeah, perfect. Uh, do you do we have uh, like abbreviation for ING? Uh, abbreviation was ING actually. ING was uh, OK. Now it got split. I think it's not here. Uh, it's it's oh okay. It has lot of uh, other business as well, right? Yeah. LG Australia, Belgium, insurance Yeah, bank. I was with I was with this company when I was in uh, India. Okay, okay. Hmm. Okay, that's nice. So we will have lot of details, right? So yeah, you were also working with this company, so you should be doing more than uh, more about it. Actually, yeah, nice. Uh, OK, so yes, um, give OK. Yeah. Perfect. Now um, in the enterprise name, once again, we have to provide the name, same name. So, so what happens is uh, in the senior resource, right? Senior consultant or implementation associate, uh, they will actually get the details from client mm -hmm. uh, regarding the enterprise. So, because if this setup is incorrect, all the setup that we do further will be uh, will go in go vain. So this is a very important and crucial uh, setup that need to be performed. Uh, OK. So primary industry, yeah. Mm, multiple industries, right? Actually. Maybe yeah, it was yeah, it had multiple, but I was with life insurance. Yeah. OK, OK. Uh, maybe we can have management. it as information. Manage uh, management of uh, companies and enterprises. Yes, please. Yeah. Yeah. 
can... Oh, your yeah, finance and insurance. Yeah, OK. Because uh, when when you say finance and insurance, I believe uh, this is going to I mean, uh, this looks like a uh, what do we say like a legal entity or uh, let me see. How does it work? So maybe before we configure, so as we have started, we can finish it off today, but before we configure, can you please open an Excel sheet? We can try to uh, put things in Excel sheet and then configure it in the system. Mm -hmm. I think it's not available, I believe, right? Uh, it's not available, maybe. Um, no, I can close this. Uh, I can close this window. Yeah, um, maybe we can open a notepad. Notepad is also fine. Simple uh, notepad. This doesn't have, a, then I should get one more laptop. Now I have to check, doesn't have. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Maybe uh, we can use the online um, Excel service, right? That is available with Google. Or uh, we can use that. For now, we can use Notepad. Yeah. Okay. So uh, let's have it as enterprise. Like type enterprise. So the company that we have uh, selected is ING. Mm -hmm. So uh, against against the enterprise, like uh, give a space or a tab and then uh, say ING. Yeah, and uh, uh, click enter. So what are the divisions that we have? Mm, we have to come up with uh, the divisions, right? So yeah. uh, so uh, where, I mean we have a, uh, like we have a division in India. So let's have it as India. Yeah, so IND. Uh, yeah, the type division. So colon. Yeah, colon and. Uh, yeah, uh, let's have it as IND. Space and IND. IND. IND, IND India. Yeah, okay, short form okay. of India, oh. yeah, IND. And then uh, they also have branches in US or UK. Um, yeah, I, I think it, maybe it was yeah? um, Europe. I think the headquarters. Okay. Headquarters was in Europe. You okay. can do. Okay. You can do USA. Let's do it USA. Also. It's going to be okay. Easy. Okay. Cool. Uh, I believe yes. Um, contacts. I'm just trying to see. I have opened the. Uh, actually, I have opened the website, ing.com, and when I click on contact, I am not able to see much details here. Uh, OK, fine. Let's have it as India and USA, which means these are the two divisions where this company is situated and then uh, comes the legal entity. Mm -hmm. So legal entity. Um, um, uh, what what are the things that we can have like uh, which places we can have in legal entity is. Uh, let me quickly review. Um, in India, where where did we have like uh, uh, where were you actually working? I was at uh, Orissa Bhubaneswar. Like my office was at Patel. Yeah, you can do. Uh -huh. We can do Bhubaneswar. Bhubaneswar, okay. And then Qatar, Ka okay. you mean, right? Huh? No, uh, Orissa. Uh, Orissa, okay, okay. So for now, uh, for uh, like, yeah, for. Uh, a practice purpose maybe we can have it as a uh, legal entity as uh, um orisa itself mm -hmm. yeah? yeah orisa and uh, uh, the branches or business unit we can have it as uh, bhuvneshwar okay okay so next and is the new york new york yeah and so these are two legal entities and business unit so maybe we can perform two or three. Uh, I mean, we can try to create two or three uh, companies like this. So uh, you can um, like whenever you have time uh, after your uh, like after your office hours, 
uh, maybe you can think of what how we can come up with an uh, enterprise. So I will also perform, uh, do something like that and uh, we can try to deploy it like deploy it in the in the system. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. So yeah, we can have one or two. Yeah. OK, OK, I believe that's that's fine. Hmm? Now uh, now open the uh, application. And we can create. Based on this, yeah, headquarters. So headquarters uh, yeah, my boss says headquarters. Like US, right? Yeah. It had two places, right? So. Uh, headquarters can be uh, one. one like headquarters can only be one. Yes, and okay. uh, if, if we have more companies then yeah. Legal entities. Yeah. Legal name. So legal name uh, ING. Uh, yeah, same name. Vyaza, right? ING Vyaza. Yeah. Yeah. ING. Yeah. So here also we can give ING. So all these details legal entity identifier registration number and legal report unit registration number. All these details will be provided uh, to us by client. So client will uh, like once the client says that uh, uh, boss I'm going to open this company so and so company they will register it with the. Um, um, like. Um, with the government, right? So government will be providing all these information. Legal address. Yes, uh, yeah. search or maybe we can create one. Yeah, click on create. So here maybe uh, we can say as ING headquarters. ING space HO. So in description maybe headquarters. Or ING headquarters, anything is fine. Address. Address line one, uh, sample line, I mean, line one will do. Yeah, just simply give line one. That's enough. And uh, postal code, straight away go to postal code. And um, mm, uh, not sure what are the details available in the system. I will search for one. Give me a minute. Um, yeah, I gave the Columbus. Yeah, so I gave this uh, like my postal place. Yeah, uh, perfect. Yeah, it's nice. Different. We got it. Yeah. So did you notice that uh, all the other things automatically uh, got yep. populated? Yeah. yeah. So. This is called as a uh, lookup. So it's been like uh, using the postal code. All the details are been looked up. Yeah. OK, uh, and uh, this will not happen for all the details. That is because uh, this will happen only for the postal codes or details, whichever has been uh, like uh, loaded in the system. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so uh, where does all these detail loaded in uh, Oracle Fusion. So uh, you will have that question, right? OK, mm -hmm. I have typed this. So from where this information are been pulled up. Pulled up so yeah. uh, maybe we can quickly create this and then look into the. Excuse me. Excuse me. So we have uh, uh, like uh, click OK. For now, yeah. Yeah, so if you see legal address is ING HO. So mm -hmm. in the bottom you will notice that. Uh, notice that uh, if you have like uh, yeah. enough information, a simple enterprise with a single legal entity operation operating a single uh, country, select an option below. OK, so continue with the interview. If we select the continue with an interview, then uh, which means it has multiple legal entities. Mm -hmm. So for our uh, case, like uh, in our case, there is multiple legal entities, right? Uh, because one is in US and another one is in India. Mm -hmm. So we can continue with that or else what we can do is uh, we can add this later on also. 
So mm -hmm. for now, let's uh, finish this using complete setup for single legal entity in a mm -hmm. single country. So let's set it up for only one uh, like country for now. So okay. please select so the second option. Yes. Save. So uh, next, next, next. Okay. Oh, so this next. is the first step that we have done. Yeah. You, have you clicked on next or? Yeah, I, I clicked on next. Okay. It's location and description. No, I believe you have clicked uh, next multiple times, I think, right? Because um, uh, I did one time. I don't know. I'll go back. Oh, yes, please. No, I did one time. See, we are at the uh, same. OK, OK. Uh, click on next. Yeah. Mm, OK. Uh, manager reporting structure because uh, all other things have been created here. See if you see all the things have been created. So there are um, uh, like uh, reference data set RDS reference data sets are created and uh, business unit has been created because as I believe we have uh, mentioned that it's going to be one. Yeah, uh, so it has created like this. So um, go back and click on multiple and then click next. Let's see what happens. Continue with interview and set up more legal. Yes, yes. Yeah. Next. So here we have uh, the option to add. Now click yeah. plus. So some companies they will have uh, so um, yeah uh, over here like uh, if uh, like uh, the, in the previous type where we said finish this uh, setup immediately uh, the company itself I mean the system itself understood that we don't have any additional information. So it has created like if you notice it has created the business unit division and all the required uh, like even the reference data set, business unit uh, set location everything in one go right but uh, for us there is multiple divisions so uh, we the in the first uh, set uh, settings we have created the structure alone mm -hmm. right only the yeah. structure we have created and now we can create uh, the business i mean the division so okay. here uh, the division is uh, uh, as you said ing um, india one india and then uh, another one shall be ing usa so please provide a name. Uh, so maybe yeah, ING. Yeah. Yes. No. Yes. Country India, location, Orissa. It was. Yeah. Search, yeah. Right? Search for Orissa, or else we can create Orissa. Uh, I believe we won't be able to find something here. Yeah. Just try. No, it's not there. So we have to create one. Cancel. Auto. Create ING Orisa. Oh, okay. So this is the uh, name of the division, like uh, where uh, exactly we are going to. I mean, the company is available. So some details like this. So line one is uh, mandatory. Yeah. New system sometimes so it so that it can populate other details. It's not populating anything, right? No. Nah. Which means uh, Sun Phi one zero one Phi is not available here. Here would hmm. be Bihar. Okay, it's no India. It's just Bihar and all. Um. So Risa is not available, right? No. OK, OK, so it's a good option for us like uh, uh, so that we can create something under Orisa. Yeah, we have we have something in. Uh, geography. So it will not populate because this particular pin code is not available. Okay. So even before we start creating it, uh, do you mind uh, if we start creating this later on? So yeah. that we can first create all these uh, information required information first. So we can cancel this. So in today's session, we will also see how to manage uh, uh, geographies. So cancel this as well. 
or okay. save it save it for now save it and close save and close save. Uh, yeah uh, yeah click ok yeah uh, and uh, cancel this like uh, cancel it in the sense uh, the cross sim uh, cross is available right across it. yeah yeah okay. we'll close this delete it yeah uh, save and close So for now we haven't done anything at all. So if you see your uh, yeah your company yeah. is available here. So if you click on ING uh, Vyasa, mm -hmm. we will get these details. Now we can click on next. So if you click on next, we can start from where we left. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah. cancel this. So we can come uh, come into this later. No 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 not there. Like uh, cancel itself. This cancel. So, Yes, so what you did now is when you clicked on the cross, you were mm -hmm. trying to delete the line which is under it. Like uh, oh. the if only if we have created something, then only it will get deleted. Yeah, OK. okay. So we have done. Uh, we haven't done anything at all, right? So mm -hmm. that's fine. So here uh, cancel. Again, yeah, on the top cancel. Yeah, uh, if you see here itself, you will notice we have an option as manage geography. Run geography, yeah. manage just 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 on the top, just on the top like okay. uh, one, Load. two, three, four, fourth, fourth one. Yeah, manage geographies. Yeah. Continue. So here, uh, yes, um, country India, right? So IND. And on the right, you have search. See, S E A search. Yeah, search. CP system on time. India. Perfect. India. Yeah. Click on India. Please wait. Yeah. Uh, over here um, we have alternate. OK, OK, go back. Just click on done. Or else wait one second. Uh, let me see I because we do have. Yeah, no worries, no worries. Um, it's been some time like these are these are uh, uh, very basic uh, foundation level data. I think. Managers, manage columns. It's fine. So set reset. Show uh, the action. Yes. Um, yeah. Over here, you have selected India, right? On the top, yeah. you have uh, actions. See, click on actions. Create yeah, country. Now, no, 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 no. Country has already been created, right? India has already been created, but we have to manage the hierarchy or structure. So let's <laughs> let's look into each uh, topic like I mean each uh, menu item. So just click on manage geography structure. Manage geography structure. Geography yeah. structure. Yeah. yeah. So if you notice here, you will see how the structure is set up. So that's the reason how why uh, it is auto auto populated. Like if you see uh, subject to grouping, everything is uh, like subject to grouping is not been checked, but the levels are set up. So state and then county, town and zip, right? Yeah. Uh, so these are the structure. This is the structure. If you click on create and add a, a geographic type, mm -hmm. you'll get a option like uh, yep. you can create something like uh, maybe for now uh, we can say sample or maybe zip what what do we say yeah yeah sample will do sample just wanted to show you how it looks save and close see at oh. the last yeah. yeah so it has been added to the last so uh, going forward you will also be able to see sample in few of the uh, places. 
okay, okay. and it is not required for us just yeah. for uh, explanation purpose i have uh, asked you to create so you can delete it so we have an option to delete it yeah. if you notice in other uh, in other levels like 1 2 3 4 we don't have the option to delete yeah right that is yeah. because it's been uh, created by the system like uh, it's been configured by oracle itself and uh, we are not meant to delete it yeah so mm -hmm. yes please delete the, the sample mm -hmm. and cancel so click on cancel so this is how we will be navigating from one page to another page and once again click on actions actions click, yeah, yeah. click on manage geography hierarchy hierarchy yes now you see you will be able to see all the states so uh, find orissa so if you scroll down yeah it's there to find orissa yeah expand it so under orissa uh, we are not able to see the place right no 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 not yes. here actually uh, you have to expand it not click on orissa so done just click on done so if you click on orissa what happens is it will take you to the uh, state level configuration like uh, how it has been configured like uh, instead click on the um, gray button right gray arrow like oh. yeah exactly expand. yeah it oh. expands yes yeah oh so it has it, all the yeah cities yes yes so cities are called as county here okay right? so if you see here we are not able to see any of the cities or counties correct mm -hmm. so what we have to do is uh, now you have selected orissa right uh, you have clicked on state mm -hmm. you already clicked on state and it is selected which means how we uh, know that it has been selected it's been highlighted it is highlighted in blue right yeah so now scroll up click on action scroll up yeah create and then create yes yeah now provide a name like a uh, uh, this is a create a county create county so we are creating a county county is the state right or uh, not the oh. state um, the towns the towns. cities yes yes so you can provide the missing town you said the oh, uh, town is missing right so you can provide a missing town no they had so many oh, i think it let me see bhubneshwar yeah, yeah, please please check please check yeah before you uh, build uh, i mean create also you can check yeah please go ahead uh, just cancel this and you can check if it is available bhuvneshwar right i will check for you yeah give me a second uh that was the capital must be there baleshwar baleshwar is there yeah is baleshwar bhuvneshwar i mean is no. it baleshwar or bhuvneshwar no baleshwar is different and bhuvneshwar is different bhuvneshwar bhuvneshwar right. is the capital so it yeah. is in yeah it's missing so it's so kind of so. weird yeah that's fine that's fine so we can create uh, uh so we have created and uh, at the bottom also so we have provided a uh, primary and alternate names right so we can add a uh, primary and alternate names like um, if you click on action on the top no no on Sorry? the top right yes yes please see what are the options yeah, so we can add multiple uh, okay. so for one name itself we can have multiple uh, names i believe like uh, uh, some people call it as uh, b h u b a n e s w r right oh, okay oh, so some people call it as yes so I think this is the word for the flights b b u b b u is code right code oh, should okay. be added at the bottom so just for an example i uh, i explained so maybe we can delete this line it's it's yeah. not required yeah well, let's keep it simple mm -hmm. perfect you're getting it like uh, yeah yeah exactly. delete it right yes please yeah. you're getting it see you are able to create uh, the locations and uh, code now you can add the code primary and alternative codes 
actions and code or else plus actions and add or else plus yeah no, no one is enough okay so this so is BBU. the you yeah. yeah yeah code type is what about right. Mm. Uh, maybe we can have this unknown. Unknown is fine. It's fine. User provider, reason trees. Okay, this is fine. Now save and, and close. close. Yeah. If you want, we can also have uh, time zone and something. So time zone is going to be India, right? India time zone. Yeah. So yeah, if we want, we can have that. So if you go down now. Now you should be able to see uh, Bhuneshwar. Okay. Yeah. Um, I think let me also check. Yes, Bhuneshwar is available. But if you expand Bhuneshwar, you won't be able to see anything at all. So click on county. Like type county is there, right? So against Bhuneshwar. Yeah. Against Bhuneshwar. Yeah. Click on county. Yeah, simply click on county like uh, this is to select that particular line. Now, similar manner, go to actions. And create. So if you notice now, now it says down. See on the oh, down, okay. down. So now you provide uh, exact name. Town name. Because inside in Bhuvaneshwar that that can be multiple uh, like uh, towns, right? So oh, maybe okay. places we say that. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Then code. Yes, please. Uh, code KV can do it. Yeah, yeah, this is enough. Save uh, it code first. type. I'm not sure if it is mandatory, so we can yeah save time. Uh -huh. Save time is fine. Save close. Save and close. So now we have the code. Yeah, so go down. Lisa. Where did Orisa go? Can't see. <laughs> it is there only. The scroll bar is on the top. So uh, yeah, there are, there's multiple scroll bar, no? Yeah. Okay. Likewise, expand this also. I think it's click on it. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So there is nothing under town. So click on town. Now, yeah, click on town. Now on the top, go and action and create. Create. So I believe this is the fourth level, right? So when we saw the structure, we had uh, what are things we had country, county, uh, town and zip. So zip. this is the zip code. Yeah. Yeah. So you can provide a zip name or maybe uh, in both the places we can give the zip code itself. Or uh, otherwise what we can do, uh, let me check how other places are being configured. Second. Couple down. Other place is not been configured actually. Uh, uh, what was the other place that you mentioned? Like, uh, I think it's US, right? US or UK? Yeah, US. Uh, selected. Mm, yes. See if we can have something. Not showing anything for now. 
geographic history. Yes, America, okay, that's America. Still loading. So country, inside a country we have uh, Or else, yeah, maybe we can go ahead. Uh, looks like something has gone wrong. Okay, system is throwing error for me. Setup and maintenance. Yeah. Okay, uh, we can straight away provide uh, 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 what is that? Uh, uh, code. Zip code. Pin code. Yes, please. Seven five one zero one five. Yeah, and likewise, and code also you can give. Same, right? Yes, yes. Right. Seven, Seven close. So this is the unknown, right? So, what type? Yeah, save and close. Yeah, perfect. Uh, so it's still running, right? Yeah. No, okay. Now, now you can go to uh, like uh, click on the setup and maintenance. So, yeah, because we have created this, right? So setup and maintenance. Setup. Uh, yes. Uh, on the IM, right? You have to click on yes. IM. Setup and maintenance. Yeah. So in today's session, actually you have learned how uh, I mean we have started to create a, a enterprise structure. So yeah. in search task, mm -hmm. give enterprise, establish enterprise or enterprise, yeah. And search. And also you have learned, yeah, the first option, you have learned how to set up a geography. So uh, manage geographies. Uh, is something uh, like uh, this section, like uh, this particular session. Uh, we we usually don't do it uh, unless it is required. Uh, so mm -hmm. we need to know where from where uh, all these data are being picked up. Mm -hmm. However, we are uh, like uh, it is something which will be already performed in the system by the senior uh, uh, senior po person. So we will be performing just the implementation, like implementation of other setups, not the uh basic uh, foundation so what we did now is the basic foundation level uh setup yeah mm -hmm. so now click on establish enterprise structure and uh, select uh, the company that you have created yeah next yes now add a division so we have yes now provide a name or maybe to check uh, select uh, the location after selecting the country India and then maybe the location yeah you know, first select the country India. Yeah, perfect now location create so we have been created it right so when we are creating only, we did not get the zip code. So now provide the zip code. Let's see if it is uh, coming up or not. No, no, click outside. Just simply click outside. Or maybe click on the name. Seven five one zero one five. It's not populating, right? No. Let me see why it is not populating. Um, geographic data provider. Good. Did I give the wrong one? No, I gave. 
just or yeah, is as it... soon as you click outside or else it... you uh yeah it's supposed to pick up this one also right the yes everything everything it's supposed to pick up everything city country state everything that's that's fine mm, maybe just because we have uh, created it now this taking oh, some yeah. time or something yeah um Search. It's not showing up with the um, yeah with state also. No no in state uh, like uh, uh, the drop down no we have something called search right see. Yeah. Search. Yeah search. Here you give uh, state's name. What is that? No no give search. You know, what you did is like once again click on the drop down search uh, and if you want to take a break or something please do let me know okay mm -hmm. yeah. mm, geography yeah orisa here orisa right yes yes and click on search button search. oh this search okay yes so now click on orisa and okay oh okay got it yeah. See, yeah, perfect. Now uh, provide the name. Uh, we um, like ing India Rory's, right? Ing. Yeah. Rorisa. Yeah. Okay. So now we have created the location. Yeah, address line one. Yeah, line one. We'll do. Attribute division is required. Okay, yeah, click OK. Uh, it is not allowing us to create. Uh, it is asking us to create uh, the division name, like in the sense, provide division name first and then come to this location. Uh, that's all right. Uh, cancel. We whenever we get this error, this is that is good only. So in name, provide um, ing orisa under underscore orisa ing underscore yeah Lisa. yeah uh, in description also we can have the same ing space or yeah so this may be vague for now however mm. uh, we will get it like uh, um, once we started creating multiple divisions departments and uh, once we set up a multiple uh, enterprise structure you will get it like yeah this is, these are the basic things that we have to do something like that you will get it yeah location uh, before we do that uh, can we uh, yeah anyway it has to be that right yeah ing underscore orisa or ing orisa line number one and then uh, pin code directly give the pin code let's see if it is picking up now yeah click on line number two no it's not populating right mm. oh. okay I'll i'll see why it is not populating it's not this is also not populating okay or search but this is okay this is coming up city city town yeah some value Yeah, perfect. Now click, uh, yeah, drop down. Click the drop down. You should be able to find ing Orisa. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Now next. So if you, uh, if you're okay to continue, we can continue. Otherwise, we can uh, stop here and continue this uh, tomorrow. Yeah. 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 So that you can take some rest, right? Yeah. Um, battery also uh, running out. Batteries, okay. yeah. I need to <laughs> get my Lucky. charger also. Sure, sure, sure.
Sure. Okay then. Uh, let's hold it uh, here. Um, yeah. You can click on save. Like uh, um, just go. Uh, yeah. This is another. This is fine, right? Yeah. yeah. Click on save. Save and close. Yeah. Save and close. Okay. So so far we have seen the basics of uh, enterprise structure, how to create uh, business unit divisions, but we haven't completed it yet. Uh, just wanted to understand if you are able to uh, like uh, analyze what exactly we are creating. Do you have any queries? Mm -hmm. No, it's Bottom. just like yeah, we are creating the legal entities like the companies at two places with their divisions. Yes, uh, so you towns. are able to understand right uh, the yeah. structure because as you have been to the industry for some time, you are able to understand what we are doing, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, perfect, perfect. Okay then. Okay then. Thank you so much for your time. We can catch up tomorrow. Yeah, we can continue yeah, with this yeah. tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, you can forward me the uh, slides. I can. Yeah, go sure, sure. I will. I will forward it to you. Yeah, mm -hmm. for the slides. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Thank you then. Have a good yeah, day. Thank you. Yeah, you too. Have a good day. Yeah.